everyone, so today I've got a review for you of some of the Iconic London products for you. So let's start with the pigment stick. I have got it in shade Icon 3. A little bit pink for my skin, or a little bit neutral should I say, because I've got quite yellow skin. Um, but the coverage of it is absolutely amazing. So anybody that's got neutral to pink undertones, this would be really, really good for you. The product went on really well. It really blended well. It's got quite a matte sort of velvety finish. So if you like that sort of finish, this is ideal for you. So the pigment stick is really, really high coverage. So anybody that likes that sort of, um, you know, really finished polished look that you would really, really like this. Um, it's really good for covering up tattoos as well. It covers up um, anything, basically. It's so pigmented, um, which I suppose is the idea of pigment stick. Um, and it comes in loads of different colors as well. Just buffing on one of their Pro Evo brushes. So this is the little box that it comes in, and this is them here. So they're really nice um, brushes, you can see. They're really like ergonomic, really nice to hold. Um, and they've got a nice dense structure in there as well. So it blends on really, really nicely. This is a good sort of size to do your whole face. Um, I'm having to sort of angle it a bit just because I had my lips and my eyes done before I started the skin. Um, but it's nice and dense, and it really makes blending foundations really easy. So next I'm going on to use the contour kit, um, as you can see here, this is sort of the size of it and this is the colours. Um, again it's really pigmented, it's quite thick and it's really blendable and the colours are a little bit on the pink side which is good for contour and um, because it makes it look like it's a shadow rather than sort of an orangey streak. Um, and there is a nice yellow colour as well for underneath the eyes in the lighter colour which I really really like. So that's what I've popped on underneath the eyes and I've tended to use the darkest one um, out of them all to do the contour. So I'm blending it all in using a different Pro Evo brush. Now this is one that's um, a little bit more angled to its ideal for contour. Again, really dense. It's got a little bit more movement in it so it's good to sort of blend in lines. Um, Again, really nice to hold, really, really easy to use. And again, you can use it on the straight lines of your nose and things like that. So I really, really like that brush. So this is the strobe stick here. As you can see, it's a really good size, like the pigment stick. Um, and it just sort of winds up to put on. It's a really, really nice neutral colour. So anybody that's got um, sort of olive skin, it works really well. Anybody that's paler, it'll work really well. It's not too pink, it's not too bronze. So I really, really like the colour. It gives a nice subtle sort of glow without anything too much, but you can really build it up. So I really, really like that strobing stick. So yeah, if anyone's got any questions about the products, feel free to write underneath and I'll try my best to get back to you as soon as possible.